It's about to go down, right? This is what we came here for. The game don't work, guys. I'm sorry. Man, it's not working. What the hell? Damn. They done scuffed the boy. Give, give y'all the medium subtitles because a lot of y'all can't read. And it's okay. And it's okay. No judgment here. I think we ready. I'm going standard because you don't get any extra joints for doing what you do. I'm about to get tossed. A lot of bad decisions coming. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by blah 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 The suspense in his well, eye. I reckon you didn't do it then. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how. You know, many. Ace. Usually it's about now I get the I didn't do it. Every time? Every time. Your car stank, bro. It smells like somebody peed in here. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. You've got an opinion then? I wouldn't say that. I go in for that innocent till proven guilty thing, even considering who they say you kill. I got much choice? Sure don't. It don't matter what you pick Regardless, up, we about to die! Could be you just married the wrong woman. Bro, this game's so damn good. Everybody played it except me. Sometimes it ain't even worth it battling with the police, dog. Don't even say shit. Any of that seem important to you? He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. He starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops and having a all his options. Is that options, the new slang for popping off? He out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed. Stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing. Bro, a bit you more got somebody to talk to, bro. I do say so. What this other time. Watch out. He out here yapping about these people. Should have been watching where the hell he was going. Got tossed. Man hit one body, the whole car flipped. So man's getting ate up in the front seat? As long as they don't come in the back seat, we alright. Game over. Oh shit. Yo, your leg is KO'd, my guy. Ah, fuck my leg. Yeah, your leg is overdone. Ooh, toss. Why the hell did he have his gun out? I did look at the car, boy. Officer. Oh, that doesn't look good. Yeah, of course not. He's not moving, and he got Family Guy. <laughs> Look at his arm. He got, he got, he got dropped. Look at that foot. Both of his feet are facing each other. Man is body. The signs are there. If I look at this dead ass cop one more time, bro. Okay. Oh, you heard a word? Look at them handcuffs. Damn it. 
That's not gonna get us out the car. We're damn cuffed. Okay, so um, yeah, break the window, bro. The Doc Martens, Stacy Adams, breaking your next favorite window. I need to drag myself out that window. But your leg broke. Look at you. What you gonna do with that, bro? Look at your leg. Yeet. He's black, you know, we don't, you don't like scary situations. Shoot, man would have been, for all I know, buddy claustrophobic. We well on our way, chief. First of all, let me get that shotty you just dropped because I need protection. Can I not get that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, get that. The officer's shotgun is Oh, so you don't want to touch it? Well, get this stick so we can poke the dead man. Bro, that's your, your leg sounding like that? Why would he have needed that? Why what would you it? pick up a bullet with no gun? Hey, that. God damn. Bro, if you don't drag that leg over here. Here, get some keys. Get out these cuffs. We are now free birds. Now why she bite your stupid ass? Go ahead and get it. Oh, free at last, free at last. In my wrist, bro. If you don't hurry up and hit this joint before you get bit on your ankles, officer. Ooh. Holy shit! Bro, hurry up! <laughs> What a damn shoddy. Look here, Carl. Get away from me. Get the gun. Pump him full of lead. The hell you mean? You got one look. Oh, boy. You so scuffed. Where are you? Get that damn shell. Don't make me do Mr. This. Officer. Mr. Officer. <laughs> Sorry. You definitely just murdered this guy. So, GG's. Shit. What the hell is this? That was all in a matter of how long you was knocked out, Chief. Um, where are we going? Help! Hey! Go get someone! Look, girl. There's been a shooting! But you shot somebody that's dead, so basically it's self-defense. What's that? What's that noise? What's that noise? What's the noise? Oh, the team that showed up. It's time to go. Carl, wrap that bad leg up and scoot your ass up out of here. Come on, bro. Buddy with that dead ass leg, get over that wooden fence. Take a breather, bro. You earned it. That leg, on the other hand, needs, hello, needs some patching up. Anybody, what's that? T set, bro. We no ladder. We do not need no T set, bro. Getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. The pandemonium Help! did not stop them from getting outside. I wonder if anybody's home. I guess I can't talk because Dallas didn't do it either, so hey. Oh, you got the... I thought my buddy leg was busted. He got the fast scoop. Fast scoop, fast scoop, fast scoop, fast scoop. I wonder Enter if anybody's home. It don't matter, bro. You're in an apocalypse. Get you some... I wonder if anybody's home. Some of the finest pork and beans you can find because that's all you're going to be eating for a good time. Somebody! Yell if you can hear me! <laughs> yeah, he definitely black. Did you hear the way he said that shit? <laughs> Somebody! Help me if you hear me! Hello? Anybody home? I need One. a little help. Not a little help. You need a lot of help. You need somebody to get that damn bone out your... Flatten that bone in your leg. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Ah, shit. Hello? 
I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. I mean, you probably, like, I don't know. Let's keep it a buck here, bro. This man was about to go to a federal prison and he's free. Of course they in the worst situation than you. This man gonna be slipping and sliding all damn game. I see it. Get your ass up. And then this man called for Jesus after he just slipped. I just thought you was about to slip again. If you would've slipped again, I was turning this damn game off. They got solo cups, they got... Did you... You don't know where that cup been, bro. Or who was drinking out of it. There's a whole zombie apocalypse passed by the T-Virus. And this man sipping out somebody else's cup. Boom. Infected. Bro, answer this damn uh, walkie-talkie. How I do it, though? How do I answer it? Inventory? We got inventory? There are three new messages. Well, answer them germs. Maybe there's something on there. Maybe there's something on there. Me and Carl are not going to get along, new bro. Messages. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just... Leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Clementine! Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Now, y'all done went through all that hard work to call this girl and name her Clementine? Daddy? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. His name Lee, but he called no, us. I'm not. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Well, where's Sandra? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. This man slipped on the same blood he slipped in already, bro. You know he gonna wake up hurt because he didn't hit his head on the damn counter. Ooh, Stacy had him boot to the face. Now you done broke your other leg. Oh, you got tripped up by a dead person. Every time, hand me that gap. Oh, me hammer. One more time. Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. Uh, I think so, too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. Ooh. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh, 
Look, I hold it down, though. No. My name Carl, cause but <laughs> I'll look after you until. <laughs> oh, look at little Clem. Can we what give her another name, bro? Clementine is a bit much to say during the an apocalypse. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. I'ma help us out, but I can't do too much with this leg, though. How you so clean in an apocalypse, Chief? You clean as hell. You took a shower? Look, you can't be running all fast now. Look at my leg. Look at the. Look, I'm busted. I'm busted up. Can't be moving that fast. Slow down, Chief. Do you have on stockings in the apocalypse? My goodness, you have it. Too good. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. The <laughs> only hot dish you gonna be eating is them pork and beans, cause ain't no food, boy. You about to eat them canned goods or some ramen. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Can we find a medic? Because my leg is toast. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Don't Holy eat us! Give us the chomp. Boy, I said, hey, I'm not. <laughs> Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. So you've seen them then. You could say that. I'm Sean. I'm saying Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. <laughs> we shouldn't be what having up, like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my Chet. family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm. A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Yeah, ain't none of your business what I am. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... Your monster's coming. <laughs> Your monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Come on, bro. Bro, how you pushing this car with that leg jacked up? That bone oughta slipped through that skin a long time ago. Y'all running towards the man. What are you those guys, neighbors too? Bro, your back tire wasn't moving, it was locked up. I don't know how you drive it. You about to run into a whole herd of them boys in the cornfield, and they don't even eat corn. Matter of fact, y'all need to get some. Y'all need to stop that truck and get a couple of them. Get a couple of them corns for yourself. Y'all boys is ain't gonna be eating for a minute. <laughs> hey, what y'all eating tonight? Pork and bean sandwiches. Mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet Tomorrow you. Tomorrow night, where the hell I'ma sleep at? Y'all play me. Can I sleep in the bed of the truck? Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Don't be disrespectful. We, uh, need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? 
Yes. Okay, then. Yeah, don't be out here man. trying to accuse me of being on Dateline, old fathead man. man. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Stitch him up. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up. Yo, on the what's good? Welcome, welcome in. How are you? Hand. What's up, America? How are you? Guys, let's have a look. I need yeah, stitches, Chief. This is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. What up, Herschel? How'd this happen? I, I fell, trying to get away from one of those things. That's so. What type of danger has the girl seen? Who knows? She had a few lonely days with nothing but the dead keeping her company. I still just can't imagine it. Consider I'm trying not to talk too much so y'all can hear the stories, because we need to pay attention. With mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there, and we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad, so I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Clementine has said shit before. She looked like she did. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? <laughs> he got, buddy trying to make sure I get out of his shit. Where are you headed tomorrow? <laughs> you're not staying here oh, another night. Get your ass out of here. Man, I know it, it got like barn spiders in that joint. I would not want to lay on that. Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that. That was a swear. Man. You said shit before, bro. Your name is Clementine. I know you did. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty much, Jay. Pretty far. Oh, okay. I'm about to say, I know you're not sleeping with that leg propped up. You gotta, you need to elevate that leg, sir, Hello. before it's swell up. Bro, you will sleep for all of zero seconds. Man was sleep with his eyes open. Hey, get up. <sighs> oh, I'm itchy. Well, you Told slept in a barn, little damn lady. Spiders got Lucky on your you don't have spiders in your hair. I'm telling you. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in no offense. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going or we won't hear the end of it. Now why the hell are we going to patch up his Ken house Jr. and then they're going to kick us Doc. out? Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's Scrap because that he's damn dumb as a bag of hammers. They ain't even, they ain't even well, nothing, He makes bro. up for it with enthusiasm. 
The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Hang on, Cap. Well, Your wife was work. looking at me like We've I stink. what those things can do out there. She's slept in the barn the too, Chief. The better. That's all I'm saying. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. <laughs> oh, snap. Duck, blink, bro. Your eyes bug as hell. I can you keep an fun? eye on your little girl here on the porch. Nah, we, we can could. visit. Nah, we cool. You have such pretty hair. We can walk It gets today. lots of tangles. Hey there, girls. How did you handle getting through the city? Can you just... Drove. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Hell no, nah, I was going to jail. Oh, I'm not well, telling her that though, they ain't none of her damn so. business. I was going to the pen. When I'm glad this... Happening to you. I'm well, glad you this happened low-key. I was going to jail. Yeah. Directly to jail. Like, ago. on the way. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Bro, I'm good. You shut your ass up. I think I've got it handled okay. Long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. You need to take With care of duck big there, head ass. Maybe, that's you sure do. that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild Wait a about minute. it, but the boat's- This man went from mackerel to dolphin. What you catching dolphin for, bro? Let me find out. This man eating dolphin. Send his ass to the pen. Not that bad. Sensation, See. man catching dolphins. I gotta watch him. He's dangerous. It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Okay, Carl. Limp your ass back around his house. Okay, that's what buddy doing. I couldn't imagine eating dolphins. Eating a dolphin is like eating penguin. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things Whatever up. Whatever you want. Ain't no I can't provide. Whatever you need. My dad doesn't know how bad it in is. In a zombie apocalypse, all yeah. I need is a Walkman and like 3,000 batteries. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. In like a... A boy. I don't know. Shot him Somebody right cassette face. tapes. I'd be listening to Sade for like ever. You gotta do what you can to survive. Like put a gun to that kid's head and pull the trigger? Fuck that, man. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh. I bashed a poor girl's brains in. Whoa. I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fast. I don't care, bro. I, I was about to die. Safe, I'm trying to be real with you. Now, if one of them joints slide up on you and there. your ass get caught up in a jam, I'm going to let you use the How's hammer and see what it feels like. This guy acting like he would not. I'm saying, like, I'm trying to live. You up here questioning me. Like, I did what I had to do, bro. And little, little Clementine wouldn't, you know, she, you should know she handed me the piece to put in work. Today, so. I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I 
walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. So that matters. Fact. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, was my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Right. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. Oh, and I start checking the attitude, friend. Go! I'll get my gun! Now we all gotta get out the boy. Y'all messed it up for everybody. I knew it. Get the fuck out of here! I knew it. Y'all ruining it for everybody. You and your badass boy on that damn lawnmower. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I thought I could help them both. You thought wrong. And now, please, just go. Get out and never come back. <laughs> <laughs> 